So, so what's happening? We're fighting the toughest guy out there because this man wanted to. So it's my honor to bring up the heavyweight champion of the world, the American heavyweight champion of the world, the WBC heavyweight champion of the world, the undefeated heavyweight champion of the world, with the highest knockout ratio in the history of the sport, Deontay the Bronze Bomber. I don't think that's more to say. <laughs> Man, he had me pumped. I don't know. Y'all ain't pumped. <laughs> Lou had me pumped, man. But first off, you know, I just like to give thanks to God, man, who is the hell of my life. Um, just like to thank Showtime. <sighs> man, y'all done put on some hell of a fight this year. And like you said, to say the best for last, I cannot wait. I like to thank my man, Shelly Singles, Shay D's. Al Heyman, you know, it's been crazy. I, I can just remember when I called Al, I like, Al, I said, it's time. Ain't no more playing games, no more. Ain't no more sitting back, ain't no more staying silent. It's, it's time to move. So with that being said, not only was it time to move in boxing, just my whole career in, in general, outside the ring as well too. I didn't, I didn't, Added new people to the bomb squad that's going to benefit and, and, and do the things that they got to do for boxing. Because it's, it's about to be crazy. We're about to take over. <laughs> I don't know about y'all, but we about to take over. I am the best. I am the toughest heavyweight in the division. I am the man in the division. I don't care what anybody else got to going on in their country or what they doing. <laughs> You gotta come through me and see me. And on November the 14th, on November the 4th, I'm sorry. November the 4th, I got so much stuff going on, it's crazy. November the 4th, <laughs> Deontay Wilder versus Lewis Ortiz, this is gonna be a hell of a fight. So many naysayers, so many, just like Lewis, like he said, he said everything. He said everything that I wanted to say. That's why I'm smiling. I don't really have too much to say, but I'm just, I'll tell you, this is going to be a crazy fight. And it's going to be a fight that it, ain't, it definitely ain't going to go to distance. I'm thinking about three rounds. Mm. Mm. And, the way I'm, and, and, and come that night, it might be in the first round. You never know. I've been tired, man. I've been tired hearing people blather their mouth, run their mouth. You know, saying shit on the internet. They want to say in front of my face. Hear my face right here. Here I go. For all the naysayers in here, because it's a, it's a lot of them in here. Don't act like it's not. For all the naysayers, here I am right here. <laughs> here I am right here. Put some more fuel to the to the fire. Because I'm gonna lose Ortiz's ass. I know he on the phone hearing. I hope you hear. I hope you hear. It's gonna be crazy. I talk that talk, so I know I have to walk that walk. And walking that walk, I ain't got no problem with. It. I ain't got no problem with it at all. I am the best. And I'm gonna show you. Instead of instead of instead of talking, I'm gonna show you I'm the best. And when I do defeat him, when I do knock him out, I want my world earned due respect. I want my world earned due credit. I don't want nobody to say nothing else. You got the only American heavyweight champion of the world right here. And y'all rather support a foreigner. Y'all rather support foreigners and, and shit like that when y'all got the man right here. Ain't nobody more better, ain't better than me. Ain't nobody tougher. Ain't nobody stronger. Physically, mentally, and spiritually. They running from me. They all scared of me. I'm the only heavyweight in the division with one knockout power. I've shown you that over and over and over again with grown ass men. <laughs> Say what you want, they grown men. I'll take you somewhere in Atlanta right now and put you against a 10 bombs. I bet you won't knock them out. <laughs> so hold the bombs. Hold all that comment, because November 4th, it's going to go down. And when it do, we'll see. And after that, y'all already know who's going to be next. I'm ready to unify. I've been ready, and I'm so serious. I'm so serious. If he the boogeyman, then I can't wait to shine a light on the boogeyman, because the boogeyman is only effective at night. That's it. And we in New York too, so you already know what happened to King Kong in New York. <laughs> so, it's a double whammy, baby. November the 14th, 
This right here ain't gotta really be advertised too much. It is what it is. It's the most scariest heavyweight title fight in, 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 in history. <laughs> because you got two. <laughs> November the 14th, man, y'all be there. Four, 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 four. Oh, damn. Four. November the 4th. November the 4th. <laughs> I, got, I, got, I got something going on the 14th with my kids and stuff like that, so they on my mind too. But November the 4th. Be that, it's gonna be a good one. Yeah, November 14th is gonna be at Disneyland. <laughs>